Good morning from Clannock Guilty Agriculture College. Today I want to update you on the dairy unit so far this year. Calving was due to start on the 26th of January, but calving started on Tuesday the 11th of January. And we have 120 cows calved on the farm so far. Um, cows have been kept inside four days after calving, and then they're let out to grazing after this, once suitable. We've continued to give cows over fourth lactation a calcium bolus after calving to avoid milk fever issues. And thankfully, we've only had two cows that have had milk fever so far. The current milk results are as follows. Butter fat, 4.46%. Protein, 3.5%. Lactose, 4.88%. Smack cell count, 180,000. Total bacteria count, 21,000. Cows are getting 4 kgs of a 16% crude protein concentrate and this will be reduced to 3 kgs from next week onwards. So far, 36% of the grazing area has had slurry applied by means of low emission slurry spreading method and protected urea has been spread on 55% of the farm. We have applied protected urea at 29 kgs per hectare which is 23 units per acre. Growth has been 11 to 12 kgs of dry matter per hectare per day from the start of February. From early December to January, the farm grew 10 kgs of dry matter per hectare per day, which is far higher than the average for the last few years. Current farm cover is 1,350 kgs of dry matter per hectare, which is very high, and we have 14% of the farm graze at this moment. Grazing conditions have been very difficult, so we've been using an on-off um, method to grazing. Thank you for tuning in for this update to the Dairy Unit in Clannock Guilty Agricultural College.